morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Whatever time it takes in your place, I just want to say hi. You're welcome to Sell Well channel. Where you learn how to sell well, that is, where you learn how to speak English language well. I'm quite ecstatic to save you and your wording the error due to mispronunciation. My name is Danae, an authorities who is always ready to help you sell well. In fact, for your voiceover, copywriting, or remedial English, kindly send a mail to this email address in the description. Okay? I trust you when I do that. Anyway, I hope you're ready to unlearn, learn, and relearn. Then, kindly do the trio. What are those? They are like, subscribe, and share the video. How to pronounce key vocabularies in mathematics register. How to pronounce key vocabularies in mathematics register. So, math learners, math teachers, lovers of mathematics, parents, friends, families, uncles, aunties, guardians, why don't you let us do the good job in pronouncing these words in mathematics, in pronouncing these words around mathematics? I'm sure you're willing, striving, ugly, doing all sorts to hear what those words are. I'll just tell them, pronounce them the after, and also say the words. Good job. Yeah, key vocabularies in mathematics. That is words around mathematics. How to pronounce or the correct pronunciation of key vocabularies in mathematics register. Here we go. So, mathematics learners, mathematics teachers, lovers of mathematics, parents, friends, families, uncles, aunties, guardians, that use these words, especially when talking mathematics, please, let's take the time to learn the correct pronunciation. I'm going to do how you pronounce them correctly. I am hope, I'm sure, you're very ready to unlearn it, learn it, and relearn it. Okay, so you wonder which is going to be the number one on my list. The number one on my list is M A T H E M A T I C S. It's pronounced mathematics. 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 So, not mathematics. Mathematics. Number two is Q U A N T I T A T I V E. You wonder why this coming on right? Good. So this word is not actually quantitative. Please let's say quantitative. Quantitative. Although American we say quantitative. The stress is on quote. Not quantitative, no. The stress is on one, two. Just like quantity, quantity, qualitative, quality. The stress are all on the first level. So quantitative, 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 quantitative. Good job. <laughs> so if you like to go with the American way, just say quantitative. Instead of saying day, no, that's where it's wrong. The next one, which is number three, is P L U S. Plus. 
not plop. If you say plops, you are saying another word. Like I used to tell you that how you said it matters twice, more than what you said. So, sound well, speak English language well. That's not how to ease of do that. And I'm sure you're right, ready, practicing, doing all sorts, striving to do them correctly. Good, I trust you. Good. So, it's plus, plus, not plus. And the real word is addition. 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 Not addition. Addition. Number four is times. Times. Not times. You know that? And the real name is multiplication and not multiplication. So, times two times two. Not two times two. Two times two. Four times four. Z is what you should know there. Not times. And multiplication. Multiplication. Not multiply. Not more. Multiplication. Good. And you know multiple. Multiple from LCM. I'm not LCM. LCM. HCM. LCM, HCM, multiple, multiple choice. You know that question that had option for you to pick the correct answer. So multiple choice, not multiple choice, multiple choice. And when you have the paper, it now stress shift to pay, pay. So multiple choice paper. Oh, do you have the multiple choice paper with you? No, I don't have it because I'm not sitting in exam, especially for now. Good. <laughs> okay, the next one is S U B T R A C T. It's not subtract. It's pronounced subtract, sub, and not sub. Subtract, and the stress in the second syllable because it's a verb. Subtract. And the next one is subtraction. You know, all words with T I O N should take stress before the syllable. Although there are exceptions like cat and you know, some scientific word. So subtract. The next one, okay, yeah. You know, we have many names for that. Difference, subtract, reduction, reduce. So subtract, subtraction, minus. And not minus. Minus the stress in the first level. Minus. So you say minus. You are saying another sound there. So minus, subtract, subtraction. The next one is is D I V I S I O N. And that is division. 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 You can say division or division. Division. The problem here is that many do say division. Division. Please. It's not division. Say division. Jen. So you should know. Division. And the other one that looks like K are divisible, not divisible. 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 The stress on V, so the V, Zabble, not Sibble, like D I V I S I B L E. And when you have the Vizable, the noun of that thing that enter the number and come out, getting many multiple numbers, is divisor, not divisor, or divisor. Divisor. The stress on what you should know there is Z and not so. Divisor. And when you have the noun to be divisive, the other one, which is adjective, is divisive. Divisive and not divide. Divisive and not divisive. You see that? That sometimes we just need to unlearn, relearn, and keep relearning them. Why? Because some of these words have etymology. The S that was Z in the I, the I, S O R is no more Z again in the I, the I, S I V E. So please 
Let's sell well. Remember how you said it. Marcus twice more than what you said. So let's sell well. The next number eight is EQ. U A L E Q U A L equal equal not equal. You don't round your mouth there because schwa equal. The stress is in the first syllable. E equal equal and we have equality equality. The stress is on qua the second syllable. Equality equality equal. Equality and equalize and equalize it like football. So, oh, Chelsea Football Club has just equalized. Wow, what a beautiful goal from Timo Werner. That was just an equalizer. Good. <laughs> you wonder why am I doing Chelsea? Remember, I'm not running commentary. But anyway, we're just trying to pass a message that it's equal. 2 plus 3, 2 plus 3 equals 4. No, you're wrong, teacher. 2 plus 3 is. So, equal. Equals to equalizer, equality, and equalize. And number 9 is equilibrium. Equilibrium, not equilibrium. A. The strength is on le, so equilibrium. 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 Please, not brom or brion. Equilibrium. No, brion. Just like you say Miriam, not Miriam. Don't worry, I'm going to do how to pronounce names. Just cross your finger and watch out for that video. And that's why I keep telling you please subscribe like and always share your comments here in this video let's have a chat together perhaps turn on the notification button so that anytime i release new videos we can always see the new one okay trust you're gonna go that good friends the next one is number nine and e q u a t i o n Wow, and this is actually the main reason I told you that I'm going to do this video in one of my last videos back then. I told you that many teachers, lovers of mathematics, many learners, parents, and whoever use this word, it gives them. Actually, I was taught in my primary, secondary school days that it's um equation. <laughs> that sounds funny. <laughs> Um, equation. The word is not equation. It's pronounced equation. 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 Please repeat after me. It's very important. If you don't simultaneous equation. Oh, don't worry. In my next video, this video is going to be on four or three part of mathematics register. Words around mathematics or vocabularies. In mathematics, that many students teachers do pronounce them wrongly. So, and it's one of them. Is it simultaneous or simultaneous? Don't worry, watch out for that. But the, what we're saying today is equation, equation, and not shun. Yeah, number nine, oh sorry, number ten is E Q U A T I O A. It's equation. Equation. This actually is the only word with the little my little research that has T I O N and does not sound shun. Yeah, so if you have it, please drop your comment. Drop your comment. Let's have a chat about it. Bob Doris is like, why are you not shun? E Q U A T I O N is not equation. Equation, please take it easy. So, you yeah, know, this is the equation. No, this is the equation. Equation. An equational, not equational. Equational. And the last and the least eight on the list is that number 11. A I N D I C U S. No. Indices in indices. The point we're making here is that the S there that is not C's is indices. 
indices, indices. Yeah, I'm sure you got that. Now the summary. Don't say mathematics. Say mathematics. Don't say numeracy. No, don't say numeracy. Many teachers learn as a not numeracy. Say numeracy. Numeracy. All four we show the numeracy. Don't say Roman numeral. Say Roman numeral. Roman numeral. Don't say quantitative. Say quantitative. 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 No. Maybe you want to like the American. Don't say plus. Say plus. Don't say addition. Say addition. Don't say times. Say times. Don't say multiplication. Say multiplication. Don't say multiple. Say multiple. Multiple choice. Multiple choice paper. Don't say subtract. Say subtract. Subtraction. Don't say minus. Say minus. Don't say division. Say division. Don't say divisible. Say divisible. Say divisor. Say divisive. Don't say equal. Say equal. Say equality. Say equalize. Equalizer. Don't say equation. Say equation. Equation. Equational. Don't say indices. Say indices. Good job. I'm sure you got that. Please let's keep striving to unlearn, relearn, and learn at our time. And don't always forget to subscribe. Push on the notification button so you can always get a new video when it's released. Tune me next time because next video is going to be a bumper two. We have many words. We are still thinking we have one or two, three videos on Mathematic Register. Catch you. Yes. I joyfully express my attitude of gratitude to you, viewers, for watching, for your likes, and your subscription. Albeit, it's actually free to subscribe. Why don't you turn on the notification button for more? Kindly help share this video to all and sundry. I also appreciate your comments on this video. Follow me at I am the name on Twitter or Instagram. Let's have a chat. Remember, how you said it matters twice more than what you said. So always sell well. Thanks and ta for now.